what they are reading as well comment and they are finding the very difficult use for it but SQL Server will help you to provide your own access to the simplest way to transform that SQL Server database into an XML let us see how it is performed ok first we have to start an SQL Server SQL Server manager so we have page 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 ok it's on the screen now now so we can never call this very heavy software because of the issue. This is the password and I'm sure we can discuss it. Okay, I already created a database with name name database and this database has contained the account table. So let us start from the spell theory. How we put up the query over it? Right click. Okay, let's select strike from count. Everyone start from the this query. This is a very basic structure query that we have. If we execute this query, we will get the data in the SQL Server format, that is the tabular format. Now we have extended this query by keyword of four and then write XML and then auto. So let's see what happens. Oh, just create an XML file from the database. How simple it is to convert a SQL Server database in an XML format. But there is unfortunately few things left. As XML file has few property and characteristics that make the file for formatted, well formatted. It's not a well formatted XML. So what it should require? It should require a root element. So if we introduce a root element in it, we use a word root like comma single code to start the data. Okay, that is UVL data. Ah, this is the bank data, yes. Real. Data. Column. Column. And again, start it again. What's the meaning? What's the meaning? Oh, that's good. Now it's in hierarchical structure and containing the data, UVL data as a root element and all the information of the account holder in it. But there is a problem with it. This is a very complex type data structure and XML is very simplified. To make it more simplified form, we create a path member that is we create this path click over here comma 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 and show introduce the name of part like this is a data yes it's a data and again just click over here click comma comma so again just create a database now so it's like a database that I need to and produce an excellent file from the database. This is all about this video. Thank you for listening to our patients.